Wednesday, January 10th, Hiller's Hockey taking on Dedham, and the offense was just unstoppable. And the one thing I look for with this Dedham team is they've had a couple of great games against very good opponents. Did they discover something about themselves to make them better overall? We'll see. And that's a goal by the Hillers. Look at that. Just like that. Nice pass. Will ja Abbott. Jacob Weinstock to Will Abbott, and the Hillers up 1-0. Famous doing battle with David Long on the boards. Up the near side is Will Abbott. Here comes Abbott on a quick break, one on two. Gets around the defenders and puts it stick side for the goal. Will Abbott showing off the fancy footwork and the fancy stick work and makes it two to nothing Hillers. Sloan in the slot and he puts it in for the Hillers. DJ Sloan saw the open opportunity, and he got that one right by Stam, and it's three to nothing with 13.44 left to go in the second period. Here comes DJ Sloan now. Sloan trying to get around the defender, looking for the shot here. The backhander, and it's a goal. DJ Sloan making it four to nothing, Hillers. There's no substitution for speed. I mean, that was just all pure speed by Sloan. That of making a substitution. Actually, they just uh, sent Andrew Mercury to the penalty box. So Hillers with the nice advantage, play. and they take immediate advantage of it. Owen oh, Delaney on the one-timer. Will Abbott with a nice play, taking the puck out from behind the net, and centering it right to Delaney. Picked up by Lindquist. Lindquist turns it away. An opportunity here. Simo's looking for the shot, and he's going to put a goal in. A beauty of a pass by Lindquist and Steven Simos. Knocks in the sixth Hiller's goal of the evening. Just a nice look by Lindquist. He, right before he got that puck, he turned around and saw Simos breaking up. Hit him perfectly. Strike. Simos up to Lindquist. Leaves it for Abbott. Here comes Owen Delaney. Delaney with the wrister and he puts it in. 7 0 Hiller's. An easy goal for Owen Delaney. He just made that one look so easy, Eric. Just great passing. Set him up, have him come right down the middle, and he's got one of the best wrist shots on the team. On the end boards, Temple trying to get to it. Sam Bloom picks it up for the Marauders. Top of the left circle, looking for the shot here. The wrister, and that's a goal! Tommy Hamlet. Tommy Hamlet making it 8 0 Hillers. A beauty of a shot by Hamlet. The Hillers grabbed the 8 0 win over Dedham and kept the winning trend going as they grabbed a road win versus Medway on Saturday, January 13th, 5-3. And then they took down Westwood on the road on Wednesday, January 17th, 4-1. Hopkinton Hillers Boys Varsity Hockey now has eight wins, one loss, and one tie on the season. Hopkinton Hillers Boys Basketball has four wins and six losses on the season. They recently came up with a couple of huge wins. On Friday, January 5th, they took down Medfield 65-57. They lost in overtime against Bellingham on January 12th, 69-64, but took down Ashland on Tuesday, January 16th, 66-37. Hopkinton Hiller girls basketball has eight wins and two losses at the halfway point of the winter season. The Hiller girls were riding a four-game win streak into a January 16th meeting with Ashland. The Clockers took a 39-36 comeback win over Hopkinton. In swimming, the Hiller girls are a perfect 6-0, while the boys are 6-2. On January 10th, the boys and girls swim team defeated Dover Sherborne in a co-ed meet, 92-86. The boys lost a close one on January 15th versus Natick, 94-84. Some other Hiller sports notes. The wrestling team has four wins, three losses, and a tie on the season. The Dover Sherborne Hopkinton girls varsity hockey team currently has two wins and eight losses. The Hiller boys indoor track team is four and one, and the girls indoor track team is five and zero oh on the season.